Hi everyone. Uh, I'm back. I'm off the medication that I was on that was causing so much havoc. The junk, uh, as I've come to refer to it. Uh, um, I saw Easy Rider today. Uh, the movie for the first time, which was uh, amazing. Uh, it's great, you know. I just like the ideas behind it. I like the story. Um, the characters. Uh, the spontaneity. The music is good. Uh, yes, so that's what's been going on. Um, I'm due to start a meditation in some form in a few days, which should be fantastic. Uh, also, I have a major appointment coming up. Uh, with the doctors who are overseeing my treatment and basically I'm just going to tell them that it's not working and they're polluting my system with all of these drugs but it's not really affecting the pain in any positive way or any of the uh, autonomic symptoms I have uh, for the dysautonomia it's not really affecting any of those things uh, positively uh, and usually ends up making me feel worse so rather than trying to attack with um, various pharmaceutical cocktails I'd like to kind of focus on being comfortable for a while uh, that would be nice so we'll see what comes of it uh, yeah okay if I think of something else I'll post it I was, and uh, suppose I still am. There's no need to speak in the past tense. Um, a very academically driven person. So, you can imagine. Um, it's very bizarre to suddenly become completely inert physically psychologically emotionally inert um, and that's one of the things I've had to deal with uh, to suddenly go from finishing what was to be my last year of school uh, year 12 for those of you outside Australia who don't know uh, to lying here as you see me now in bed it's a very bizarre and very profound change to make and it occurred very rapidly uh, so it's changed me a lot. I have no academic prospects at the moment. No prospects in terms of my own independence. Uh, no, no girlfriend, not that I ever had one. But 
it's all very it's all very bizarre it's just suddenly suddenly very quiet on some fronts and that's difficult to accept but I'm doing my best and by no means am I complaining I hate complaining I'm just trying to be honest um, it's very lonely I hardly ever see uh, any girls anymore uh, which yes I do get very lonely but <laughs> I'm trying to continue my own self education uh, for what it's worth in my bed bound heavily medicated state um, I'm learning about all sorts of different things on the internet reading lots of audio books and other books I like to read a lot although I find printed books uh, quite difficult but I'm going to read uh, Alice in Wonderland and Alice Through the Looking Glass which should be interesting a staple in many people's library for various reasons whether it's about the quality of the story or popping some kind of hallucinogenics uh, A little from column A, a little from column B, perhaps. Uh, in my case. Not that I'm doing anything illegal. Yes, it's all legal, folks. And the vast majority of it is unpleasant. Uh, also, some audio books by Ram Dass or the man who became known as Ram Dass which should be interesting in itself um, a book on meditation and Eastern philosophy and also uh, the King James Version of the Bible which I'm very interested in um, not just for spiritual reasons but also just so I can be well read and well informed um, the New Testament is read by none other than James Earl Jones which uh, is worth the price of admission uh, or the price of purchase in this case alone so that should be very good um, but the point of this video is to um, invite uh, you, the viewers, that sounds pretentious, but whatever, you, the viewers, to ask any questions that you might have about myself, my interests, my disability, my illness, um, keep it appropriate, keep it reasonable, but feel free to comment or to um, post a video reply to this video and I'll get on to it. It seems like an interesting project. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you on the dark side of the moon.